So first I'll be starting out by using my chapstick by EOS and it's the strawberry one. And next I'll be priming my eyelids with Eden by Urban Decay. And next I'll be using Venus by the Naked Basics palette all on my lid. Next I'm going to be using tape on the outsides of my eyes so that it makes a crisp line. And then I'm going to be using Pinky Swear in the world's famous neutrals palette just in my crease. And now I'm going to be using Sin by the Naked palette also in my crease. It's a little bit of a darker pink so it makes a good dimension. Then I'm going to be using Fiji by the Sephora palette, also in my crease. It's just a little pink color. And now I'm going to be using Quick Look, be Quick Look Busy by the world's famous Neutrals palette also. Just a tiny bit. This is a brown color, so I don't want it to override the pink. Now I'm going to be using NYX Jumble Eye Pencil in Milk all over my lid but not so much on the crease so it covers the other colors. And then I'm just going to be blending that out just with a concealer brush because I don't want the lines too harsh but I also don't want it too too white. Next I'm going to be using Quick Look Busy also by the world famous Neutrals palette just to blend that out a bit so the white doesn't look so harsh. Now I'm going to be using Toasted in the Naked palette just on my lid on top of the white just to make it more neutral with the crease. Now I'm just going to be using a clean fluffy brush and just blending all of that so there's no harsh lines. Now I'm just going to be using St. Vincent by the Sephora palette right in the inner corners just to brighten them up a bit. And I'm just going to be taking off the tape also. Now just with this big foundation brush, I'm just gonna, there was a line that came from the tape so I'm just gonna be like blending that out a bit so it doesn't look so defined. Now I'm gonna be using Quick Look Busy by the world's famous neutral palette again just on my waterline like on the bottom and I'm just gonna be blending that out and now I'm gonna be using the Tarte Eyelash Curler with my Better Than Sex too Faced Mascara. I absolutely adore this stuff. I just got it the other day. I'm just going to be doing that to the other eye also. I'm going to be applying two coats of this mascara. Now I'm going to be using the Porefessional by Benefit just on near my nose. That's where most of my pores are, so I'm just going to be using that over there. Now I'm going to be using the Revlon Color Stay in 220 Nude all over my face with a beauty blender, a damp beauty blender.
Now I'm going to be using the Boing Concealer for my under eyes. And if I have a little bit of extra redness on my forehead, since I do have a lot of acne on my forehead, I'm just going to be using some extra coverage there. Now I'm going to be using the Neutrogena Skin Clearing Mineral Powder in Classic Ivory 10 all over my face with a stippling brush. Now I'm going to going to be just using this little sample size of Too Faced Chocolate Soleil Bronzer in medium deep with an angled brush. And I'm just going to be applying that on my cheeks just to make it more chiseled and more defined. And I'm also going to be using my stippling brush just to blend that out a bit because it was a bit too harsh for me. Now I'm going to be using Benetint by Benefit and I'm just going to be putting three dots near my contour and just blending that out so it makes a cute little rosy sheen to my cheeks. Next I'm going to be using Girl Meets Pearl and I'm just going to put that like where my highlighter would be because this is very illuminating and it's going to make it look like a highlighter. Now I'm going to be using my Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Bar to go and I'm just going to be outlining my eyebrows first with the pencil and then I'm going to be using my e.l.f. eyebrow kit Now I'm going to be using the powder just to fill them in and then I'm going to be using a spoolie just to blend that out a bit so it's not as harsh and then I'm just going to be using the Anastasia Beverly Hills the clear brow gel on top of that. Now I'm going to apply this Avon lipstick in the color Twinkle Pink and I'm just going to be putting that on my lips. It's just a nice light pink. Thank you guys so much for watching and if you like this video then please thumbs it up, subscribe and comment if you would like some more and yeah so thanks guys I hope you enjoyed this video.